Welcome to the Lyra Clinical Virtual Consultation Part 2. I'm so excited to share a virtual consultation between an esthetician and her committed client. I want to share with you what an interesting, fun, and rejuvenating experience it can be for both you, the skincare professional, and your clients. Our clients need that personal connection more than ever. Over-the-counter skincare products have seen an 8% increase since mid-March. Our clients need to have the solutions to their skincare concerns, but they're not getting that personal connection and guidance from a professional when they purchase over-the-counter products. If your clients are used to seeing you every two to four weeks, let's connect with them virtually every two to four weeks. This is a whole new game. The rules have changed, so we need to adapt and create so that we can keep up with the current conditions successfully, helping our clients to maintain the investment they've made in their skin, helping our clients to protect against the stressors that are new to their environment, and continuing the correction at home. Okay, so I'm so excited about this next section. This is where we're gonna take everything we just talked about and we are going to put it into practice. The lovely Brenda Cumming has agreed to be our model. She is going to play the role of a committed existing client. I will be her esthetician doing a virtual consultation and we'll get a chance to really see this in action. Now, if you haven't met Brenda, Brenda is one of the owners and founders of Lyra Clinical Skin Care, as well as the owner of a very successful medical spa in Colorado. Brenda is a medical aesthetic nurse who has been in the industry for a very long time. And if we're lucky, she'll let us pick her brain about the current situation and what she anticipates the next few months looking like. Hi, Brenda. Thank you so much for joining us today. Are you ready to take the back seat and be the patient today? You know how hard that is for me, but yes, I am. I do. I appreciate it so much. I know that you are normally the person in the driver's seat. You take such excellent care of your clients and patients at your medical spa, medical aesthetics in Evergreen, Colorado. I hope that at the end of this, when you're done being the patient, that maybe you'll share some of your expertise with us. Sure, I'd be happy to. How are oh, you? I'm good. I'm doing really so well. nice to see you. It is so nice to see you. I've missed you remotely. I miss you too. Yeah, I'd like to figure out the like whole virtual hug thing. You know, I don't want to do this elbow bump. I'd like to actually. So just seeing your face though is nice. It's very nice you to too. connect. Very happy to see you. Well, what's changed about your skin last time since last time? <laughs> Where do you want to start? <laughs> <laughs> We've been in lockdown for, what, three weeks. Um, I, you know, definitely could have a review over my home care for sure. Okay. What about I'm running out of some? I'm running out of products and I definitely, and, and our weather is, is like today it's 70, but tomorrow's going to be 30 and we're going to have snow, but the sun's out today and I live at elevation. And oh, hi. Uh, 8,400 at my wow. house. Do you, so, are you able to breathe or do you have to use like a oxygen mask when you get home? No, I'm used to it. It's taken some time to build up all these red blood cells, but yeah, I'm used <laughs> to it. But my skin is feeling a little stressed because I think we all are feeling very stressed. You know what? I actually had the first pimple that I've had in years show up right in the corner of my mouth. So it was really pretty. Luckily oh, it was self-isolating so nobody could see. <laughs> so yeah, well, Brenda, I really want to go ahead and take advantage of this virtual consultation to use your hands as an extension of mine because I can't put my hands on your face and do my analysis the way I normally would. So I need your hands to do that for me. What I okay. want to do is let's start with a cleanse. And I okay. know that you have the Mystique Illuminating Cleanser at home, which is one of my favorites. So go ahead and apply a nickel-sized amount on your clean hands. So that's very important just to make sure that your hands are clean before you start the cleanse. Perfect. Yeah. And then I don't wet my face or anything like that. 
Nope, you're going to apply that directly to dry skin. This is a cream-based cleanser and it needs to interact directly with your skin without being broken down by water. But I do want you to really pamper yourself with this cleanse. I want you to massage. I want you to give yourself 60 to 90 seconds of pampering. You deserve it. While you're doing that, I want you to listen to what your fingertips are telling you. I want you to look for texture issues. Do you have areas that are dry, a little roughened, um, maybe excessive oil somewhere? And I need to know that so that I can take notes so I make sure to get you on the right home care. And do I take this down to my neck? I do. I love it all the way Just. down to my neck. If you're in the shower, you know, go ahead and do this cleanse before you get into the shower. Take it all the way down to your decollete and then get in the shower and rinse everything once you've get, had a chance to massage thoroughly. I'm really surprised at how, how far this goes for just the little amount you told me to use. It's very highly concentrated and it has amazing slip. So a little goes a long way. Little goes a long way, little goes a long way. Okay, so Brenda, I'm keeping track here. So what I wanna know, that Mystique cleanser that you just used, is the bottle more than half empty? It's about half empty. I bought it, okay. what, three months ago? I actually show that you bought it right around the first of the year, so that's about right, maybe okay. a little bit more than that. So let me go ahead and I'm gonna put you down for a replacement so that you don't run out before we have a chance to see each other. Okay, great. Hey, let's go ahead and rinse your skin. Do you have a soft towel ready to, to, to blot your skin to dry it? Okay, perfect. So go ahead and rinse your skin. Ma'am. I did notice a few things when I was massaging. Hey, let's talk about them. Okay. My forehead feels a little dry, especially right here in the upper left. Seems to always okay. want to chronically peel there. Okay. My nose feels a little rough. I'm sure it could use some love with some extractions. Well, you know, Brenda, I actually have just the product in mind for you. I don't want you to extract them yourself. Can you repeat that back to me, Brenda? Say it again. I need your commitment on this. I will not extract myself. I will not extract myself. <laughs> I will not extract myself. <laughs> okay. I, I have the perfect product that I'm going to make sure we get out in your order today to help with that dry texture from the sebaceous filaments that have maybe gotten a little out of hand since you've had a chance to come and see me. Yeah, the pores on my nose are are growing. And then I feel a bump or two here. I don't know if it's a follicle or, you know, just some, I don't know. Some stress acne maybe? No, I wouldn't be stressed. Oh no, you're very zen right Not now. Not at all. Here. Yeah. I'm sure we're also okay. mm -hmm. zen right now. Okay, so I don't show on my records that we've ever sent you home with the ice clear stick. I just what want to confirm that. That is actually the magic wand for acne. So what it is going to do is you're going to take a clean hand, you're going to take the ice clear stick, you're going to gently depress the tip and get a little bit of the solution. It's a poly acid solution that is going to help control the oil, reduce the inflammation, prevent pigmentation, and literally stop that pimple in its tracks before it has a chance to form and become visible. So if okay. you don't already have one, I think we should put that magic wand in your toolbox. Can I, does it travel well? It does travel well. You need to make sure that it is sealed completely. You need to make sure that they're, I'm, I'm the worst about this. I never remember to get my caps on all the way. So as you're packing your travel bag, make sure you do one last check and make sure that it is sealed and closed completely and then stick it in a Ziploc bag. Okay, great. Hey, I have a note of that. All right, anything else you notice during the cleanse? Yeah, my face feels a little more hydrated right now, that's for sure. The Mystique Illuminating Cleanser is my favorite for dry skin, especially if you're dehydrated. And at 8,400 feet, it's, it's an all-day task to keep your skin hydrated. It really is. Yeah. Okay, what's your first step on cleanse skin normally? I know what I have you doing, but I wanna make sure that you're staying on track with the program. Well, you recommended that I should use this ProLite serum. Absolutely. Absolutely. And that it's important to put that on your skin 
right after you cleanse? Yes. On as we, that morning and night, right? Yes, morning and night, because as we've discussed in the past, pigmentation being a Fitzpatrick one of Irish descent, you have been managing your acne for a very long time, and we don't want to backslide. So using the ProLite is going to block the mechanism in your body that creates that pigment. You mean my pigment, not my acne, but yeah. You know, I did, have, I did have a lot of freckles when I was younger. I've done a good job of getting rid of those. You absolutely have. I'm still fighting that same good fight right now, so. Yeah. Okay, so ProLite is applied. I watched your application technique. It was exactly the way I recommended. Now, are you using two drops or are you using three drops? About right a pump and a half. About a pump and a half, and you're taking it down to your neck with that I pump and a half. Well. I was listening to you, but yes, I'll put some down here because it needs it. Well, the nice thing about the ProLite Serum is it's not only a very powerful skin brightener, it also has ingredients that are powerful skin firming ingredients. So I we're really getting... like it. Do you? Do you love the way it smells? Yes. Love it. Love it. Perfect. So where are we quantity wise? Is it more than half empty or are you... I showed that you purchased this about four weeks ago and if you're using it morning and night, I would recommend that you purchase it right now because you probably will run out in about two to three weeks. Well, then I'm going to need it because we're still on lockdown. So yes. Okay, let's get you that because that is such an important item to continue to protect the investment you've already made in your skin. So let me go ahead and get you down for one ProLite serum. Okay. Okay. Next step. We're, it's the morning. So what do you do normally in the morning is your next step. Something to hydrate, something to calm your rosacea. So the Biohydra C serum, wonderful. Yes. And how much of the Biohydra C are you using? We recommend between one to one and a half pumps to do the face and the neck. Yeah, I'm using about, about two pumps. About two pumps and you're taking it all the way down? Yep. Yes, I am. Okay, okay perfect. Perfect. Oh, this feels so good. And I, bet I think I've really it. noticed a reduction in my redness by using this. Did you all change the formula and put something different in there? You know, you've been using Lyra for a really long time. Mm -hmm. So yes, absolutely. Since the beginning of your use till now, we added probiotics. We put it in an organic aloe base. We added mask tech. That's an exclusive ingredient that you may not have heard of because only Lyra Clinical uses it. We use it because it's an anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial. It helps with acne, it helps with hydration, and it's just absolutely phenomenal as an all-around skincare ingredient. I think this is my favorite product. You're not alone. Almost everybody thinks that the Biohydra C is their favorite product. And you know, it's nice because it's perfect for you. It would be perfect for one of your boys. How are your boys, by the way? They're good. I miss them. Good. I'm They're hanging unsure. in there. Mama I have them on. I have them on Lyra as well. Of course you do. You're a good mom. Thank you. So anybody can benefit from the Biohydra C. So I'm not surprised to hear you say that it's your favorite. It's my favorite as well. It's my favorite. And I cannot live without this product. And seems like it might be a little low. Okay. So we are going to make sure that you do not run out of your Hydra C serum. Okay. Okay. Next, I am going to guess, based on your information, that your next step is going to be the Mystique Beauty Oil. Yes, you're right. Yay, I it's love how well you follow directions. I love that you're following our program. I'm listening. It's you working. Listen. It's All working. Right, so. It's amazing. I mean, most 40-year-olds would kill for your skin. Right, thank you. I'm staying 40. Staying 40. You can't prove otherwise. I'm going to be 40 for the rest of my life. Mature, sophisticated, yet youthfully vital. Mm. Gosh, the smell on this oil is amazing. I'm actually a little jealous right now. I, I wish I had gathered my products so I could sit here and sniff them with you. See, so it just completely smooths out my forehead. It doesn't feel dry or scaly at oh, all and it doesn't feel oily right because it's a dry no. oil it's going to deposit no and i was a little hesitant about that and you were right I know. I know it was tough to convince you that your skin would love that liquid tough. gold liquid gold you know when i find my sugar daddy i'm going to buy that by the gallons and i'm actually going to pipe it into my big old claw footed tub and i'm going to bathe in uh, 
Bikini oil. This is a fantasy that I've had for a while. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> about that off camera. TMI. <laughs> no, the um, beauty oil. I put the rest is, on my hands. Yes, absolutely. Keep your hands safe because you know what? Your hands are exposed to everything, and if they get cracked or overly dried during this wash, sanitize, wash, sanitize, wash, sanitize that we're doing, that cracking and chapping that can occur can actually leave you vulnerable to exposure of pathogens. So make sure you're okay. keeping your hands as hydrated as your face. Okay. All right, let's take care of those beautiful eyes. You should have your Mystique Perfecting Eye Cream that is going to help with fine lines and wrinkles, not that you have any. It's going to help with under eye puffiness. It's also going to help because you're gonna bring it all the way up under the brow bone. It's going to help to prevent that crepiness that can form if we ignore that area. Your, your application is absolutely perfect. You're just gently patting it in and all around the eye area. That's perfect. So April, I can't get Botox. What am I, will this help? This does actually help. You have a peptide in the Mystique for Perfecting Eye Cream called Argeline, and it does help extend the life of Botox. Speaking uh. of which, I don't have anything in your record showing that you have the Pro Firming Serum. Am I correct? You don't have it sitting there on the counter, right? Okay, so I need to get you on the Pro Firming Serum because between now and when you can get back in for your Botox, this is going to help extend the life so that you are going to come out of captivity looking as good as you went in. So let's get you on the Pro Firming Serum. It's an award-winning product that uses peptides which naturally communicate with our body to relax the muscle, relax the nerve, so that you can extend that beautiful benefit of the Botox that you enjoy. That's awesome. And when would I use that in my routine? You are going to use that at night. Okay. And the reason I want you to use it at night, you can actually use it morning and night, but I recommend using it at night because when we go to sleep, our bodies do their cellular repair. So if we're depositing all those beautiful nourishing ingredients and building blocks for repair into the skin, our body's able to maximize them while we're asleep. Okay. Awesome. Perfect. Thanks. Mm -hmm. All right, Brenda, before you step foot outside into your beautiful yard with that beautiful view, I want you to protect your skin. And even if you're not going outside, we want to protect against blue light. We want to make sure that if you have any lights in your home that emit any type of fluorescence, I want to make sure that your skin is protected. I've seen the windows in your home. They're beautiful. They're big. They let sunlight in. So if it's bright enough for you to read a book by, it's bright enough that you're being exposed to UV. So let's go ahead and let's get your beautiful BB cream out and let's do a proper application of the BB cream. Show me how much you use because I wanna make sure you're not overusing. This is very, very concentrated and powerful. About that much. Perfect. And then you're going to just kind of pat it around everywhere. You're not going to try and massage, right? No, you told me to put it on the top of my hand and warm it up a little bit with my body temperature. Exactly. And then just start it in. Exactly. That's perfect. And then if you need to get a, a nicer finish, if, if the padding isn't giving you the finish you want, I actually have a small kabuki brush that I just kind of blend everything together when I want to get that perfect airbrushed look. And you can build on this, right, if I needed to? Absolutely. So you're using the BB Bright that is only lightly pigmented because it has the additional benefit of a brightening ingredient. Since I know pigmentation is your number one concern, that's why we're using this to both protect, hydrate, and create that beautiful glow for your skin. So if you wanted more coverage, we could either add an additional layer of the BB Bright, or we could actually put you on your the same shade with a fully pigmented BB cream, and that would be the BB Blanc. So you could put the BB Bright first, and then you could layer with the BB Blanc if for some reason you needed additional coverage. However, Brenda, you don't. Your skin looks beautiful. Thank you. Another trick, I don't know if you've tried this, but tapping just the tiniest bit to the under eye area will really make the eyes pop and really reduce any appearance of under eye circles. I like to call it luminizing the eye area. Oh, nice. Let's look before you look do the other one. Let me see. Look at me. Oh, see? Already looks better. Let's do the other eye. Oh, it does. Love it. Cool. Okay, you picked up your Mystique eye cream last time I saw you. You should have at least another month 
So we will make sure to connect before then and make sure you're on track, but I don't think we need to order that one this month because you just picked that up and it is so concentra concentrated, you shouldn't have to reorder it quite yet. Okay. Okay. Great. You are ready to face the world. You look absolutely beautiful. Let's go think? ahead and talk about what I'm going to have you add to your current program because there are new circumstances. There's more stress. We're at home. There are things that are happening to our skin that aren't normally there. So what I want to do is I want to, I want to recommend one of my very favorite products. It's called the Mystique Illuminating Polisher. This is okay. something that we can create a protocol, a home treatment, using this to help with those outrageous sebaceous filaments that are running amok right now because we haven't had a chance to extract them and you're being very good and not extracting them yourself. That's right. I am. That's right. So we are going to get you on the Mystique Polisher. This is an amazing mechanical exfoliator that is infused with botanicals, healing, anti-inflammatory ingredients that are going to take care of those out of hand sebaceous filaments, those naughty sebaceous filaments, and really get them back in line gently and effectively. So the Mystique Illuminating Polisher is something that you can use twice to maybe three times a week if you feel like you need it, and you put it on before you get in the shower. So when you wake up first thing in the morning, before you jump in the shower, go ahead and apply a nickel-sized amount onto your hand and then pat it everywhere. And then you're going to just polish, 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 really focusing on those areas that you want to focus on. So okay. that Mystique Polisher is going to become one of your absolute favorites. It's one of my top three must-have if I end up on a deserted island, I'd like my polisher, my beauty oil, and my BB cream with me because when I get rescued, I need to look amazing. <laughs> I need those three products. I need to like look you were not deserted on an island. Okay. If I'm if I'm deserted on an island, I can't look like that. I can't look no. like I was deserted. I want to get rescued. I mean, I'm going to probably have some. Well, I'm going to leave that alone. We don't want to Speaking talk about not being able to be waxed right now. I don't want to open up that. <laughs> well, yeah, I didn't want to point that out. Uh, <clears throat> I do have a question. Since I can't get in to see you for appeal, mm -hmm. what can I use at home or at night to get my skin kind of turn, turning over a little bit? Do you, any recommendation? Absolutely. I, and I, I apologize if I haven't recommended this before. It's a fairly new product. Well, I usually see you on a regular basis. I know. So you're able to get your treatments and, and you're so compliant and you're so dedicated and committed to your skin that this hasn't really been necessary for you. But what I want to do until I get to see you again, I do have a little secret weapon that I can recommend. It's called the Pro Anti-Aging Pads. It okay. heals that we use in the treatment room. So it's a poly acid blend of the different acids and alpha hydroxy acids that make up those peels but in a lighter dose that you can use one to two times a week at night it's just a jar with pre-saturated pads so it's a single use pad you'll simply take one pad out and you'll exfoliate your entire face with the pad focusing on areas of concern that little friend that's coming to visit down on your chin you can actually press the pad and hold it against it so that it will control and reduce that, help it heal faster. These are pretty strong, Brenda, so I really want you to start out just once per week at night, okay. and then move up to twice a week, depending on how your skin falls in love with it. Right, because I, I don't really want to trigger my rosacea. No, we don't want to, we don't want to trigger do that. that, and I want you, after you have done the Pro Prep pads, I want you to go ahead and do your Biohydra C Serum on top, and okay. finish with the Mystique Illuminating Beauty Oil. You already have those. We'll reorder the um, Hydro C that you're low on, but I wanna just add one or two things that can continue your correction at home and that you can use your existing products to create this home correction treatment that you can awesome. do one to two times a week maximum until I get to see your pretty face in person. And at night? Only at night. Okay. Only at night. And don't worry, Brenda, right. when I put your order together, I'm going to make sure that I've written out a personal protocol for you to follow so that thank you. you have all the information available. Okay, thank you. Okay, so we've got your polisher that you're using twice a week in the morning before you go into the shower. 
we have your pro anti-aging pads that you're going to do one time okay. per week to start, and then we'll work up to two times if we feel it's necessary. Okay. We're going to be restocking your Mystique Illuminating Cleanser, your Pro Light Serum, and your Biohydra C. And since we're recommending the pro anti-aging pads that I'm going to have you press against that area that is struggling with a little bit of congestion, at this point, I'm not going to run the, recommend the ice clear stick because I want oh. to, I want to keep your program easy to follow and simple for you. I don't want you to get overwhelmed, and I don't want you to overuse because we have to be very aware of the barrier function. And as much as we want to just treat, 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 we have to protect, we have to heal, and we have to be very aware of the barrier function of the skin, which is part of our immune system. It's part of what makes our largest organ in our body so very capable of protecting us and being part of that strong immune system. Okay, well, I trust you. I know, I thank you. Um, let's go ahead and talk about the best way to get this order for you. I am currently in my office, just shortened hours, so I'll only be available for curbside on Tuesday and Thursdays from 10 until five. If you'd like to come and sit in the parking lot, call or text me that you're there, I will bring it out. You can roll the window down on your passenger side. I'll be wearing gloves and I can put it in your passenger seat for you. So that way we're still maintaining social distancing, but I get okay. to see you at least a little bit. And I'll get um, to at least see you from afar. And from afar, from afar. To get out. I'll have to go to the grocery store so I can well, just do that. Okay. Don't make a special trip when you're going to the grocery store or the pharmacy. Go ahead and stop by. Just let me know. Um, if I need to make special arrangements, of course, for you, my A client, I can. Thank you. Now, if Take that does care of me, thank you. I do my best. I do my best. Well, we love you. We love having you come to our business. Our whole staff just appreciates the level of commitment that you have to your healthy skin. So, thank you. You've done a great next job. Next time, if you can't do curbside, you live within a five mile vicinity of our business. And so, we are actually offering a delivery service. So, we can leave it on your porch. We'll make sure that your home, which I'm guessing your home right now, We'll make sure that we text or call you before we leave it on your porch so that you know it's there. So that's another okay. option. So if you can't make it to pick it up, just let me know and I'll, I'll, we'll send one of us out, one of the staff out to deliver it for you. Thank you. That would be great. Perfect. If I wasn't able to do those, of course, we have a great relationship with our FedEx and our, Zoom and our um, UPS carriers okay. here. We love them. They take such great care of us. So I'm happy to put it in the mail for you as well. Or have it delivered by one of our wonderful delivery guys. Or Thank yes. you. So, Thank you. I don't want to run out of my products. No, I and like. I don't want you to. Brenda, you have been so committed and you've invested in having healthy, beautiful skin. And I want to protect that investment from now until we get to see each other again and we can continue that maintenance, protection, and correction. I want your skin to stay bright, beautiful, and healthy until I see you again. And would you please book an appointment for me in May? Actually, yes, I am starting to book starting May 15th. Okay. So in the past, you've come in in the mornings on Tuesdays. Is that still the best day and time for you? I'll make it work. I'll be desperate. <laughs> <laughs> well, my very first appointment, the very first day. Um, but I want to make it convenient for you as well. So um, let's go ahead and see. Let's see. We have on May... So we're opening May 18th. That's the first Monday after the 15th. Okay. So we're opening on May 18th. You love Tuesdays. I do have a morning appointment. It's a little early. Is nine o'clock too early for you? I'll take it. Okay, let's go ahead and get you booked. Putting for, it in right now. Yep, yeah, May 19th at 9 a.m. That gets you the first appointment of the day. It's in my calendar. I love it. I can't wait to see you. Do you have any other questions for you. me today? Uh, yes, I had one more. So at night, I'm using my, I cleanse my face, use my ProLite, mm -hmm. and then you want me to use my vitamin C at night or my Pro Firming, and then the night when I'm not using those pads, you're going to send me, do I need anything else on my skin? You already have your Pro Hydrating Cream, and you That's already have your Beauty Oil. Okay. So those are things Fine. that you can, so you can do the Pro Pad at night and then we're going to finish with the biohydrosis serum 
and we're going to finish with the beauty oil. So that's what you're going to do the night that you use that. We don't want to overstimulate the skin that night. Your okay. regular nights, the nights that you're not using the pro anti-aging pads, that's when you're going to use your pro firming serum, your pro retinol cream, and then finish with that mystique illuminating beauty oil. I'll make Got sure it. and write that down so that you have that information to the changes in your protocol. I'll use okay. one of the, you've, you probably have seen these before. I usually send them home. It's a little prescriptive pad that is going to walk you through each one. And it has a nice little description of the products as well. So you remember what we talked about. Okay. Thank you. Any other questions? No, that, was, that helped a lot. Thank you very much. Perfect. Brenda, would you mind if we switch gears a little bit and switch your hat and instead of talking to you as a as a patient can we talk to you as, yeah <laughs> you, you can keep your headband on i think it's darling but really i want to chat with you about your experience in the industry as a medical aesthetic nurse as one of the creators and founders of lyra clinical skincare multiple award-winning skincare line I want to talk to you about what you are doing right now to stay connected with your clients on a personal level on a personal level how are you keeping that strong connection well when we got the news that we had to close as mandated on march 24th my now, team and Brenda, I, I need to interrupt you here close meaning your medical spa right my medical spa as mandated by the colorado department of health and we um i just got my team we started contacting all our patients, letting them know what was going on, and offered basically what you're doing for me right now. FaceTime yeah. consults, phone consults, email, and I'm in my office three days a week from 10 to 2, taking orders and either doing curbside delivery or I'll ship to them or I'll stick it in their mailbox on my way home. I live in a small town. But we have proactively contacted our patients so you're Just checking in on person. that and saying i you know i've had 18 years of owning this business so not only are they patients are also friends some of them are family we're just all kind of checking on each other and i'm just making sure that they're maintaining their results because i personally feel like 80 percent of their results whether they get botox filler laser peels uh, they need their home care absolutely you know to keep looking good absolutely, absolutely. And it's working, you know, I'm not, they're all appreciative. Um, some now we're into what week three. It's been interesting because a lot of that has picked up even more where um, today even I'm going to have probably four or five orders that I need to fill. And it's That's been because we're not so rushed anymore. I feel like I can actually spend a few minutes talking to some of my patients and just like reviewing their home care and making su suggestions like you did with me. Perfect. Yeah. So next question, as a 45 year old woman who's been in the aesthetics industry as a medical aesthetic nurse for a very long time, mm -hmm. you've been through this, you've been through recessions, you've been through upheavals, you were, you went through 9-11, all of those heavily affected the beauty industry. What can you tell me about the beauty industry and what hope can you share with those of us who are going through this for the first time the beauty industry is resilient that's what i've learned so 2002 i opened this practice right after 9 11 i think yeah wow i think so yeah that's about when that was 2008 we had a recession now we're in it again but don't, well we don't remember because we weren't alive really then but in world war ii what were women buying Lipstick um, and pantyhose. Oh, pantyhose. I remember. Pantyhose. That. Remember that word? I and do now, remember pantyhose. <laughs> I bet they come back, you know, at some point. And now women are going to buy their skincare products and Botox because I anticipate that nobody who's had Botox is going to try to go without it for very long. I just don't see that. We've worked too hard to maintain our correction. None of us look our stated age anymore. And I want to keep it that way. But I, I am confident that we're all going to be fine. And the one nice thing about being in the beauty industry is that we seem to rise to the top, survive and have that resilience. Wonderful. Brenda, thank you so much. This has been such okay. a pleasure. It's so nice to see you. And I thank you so much for sharing your expertise. And it's nice to see you too. Nice to be seen.
So Brenda, I am going to let you get back to it. I know you have a million things to do. You're very busy and thank you. Be safe and be well. Thank you, April. See you soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Thank you so much for joining us. I hope that this virtual consultation series of best practices and a demonstration has helped invigorate you to take your virtual consultations to the next level. If you have any questions at all, don't hesitate to connect with your local Lyra clinical representative, or you are always welcome to contact our customer service team at 877-440-5472. Be bright, be beautiful, and be healthy.